Iraq, the cradle of civilization. It was on the fertile banks of the Euphrates and the Tigris rivers where reading, writing, mathematics and civil laws were all first introduced. With a phenomenal ancient past and an exciting future ahead, Iraqis are eagerly looking forward to writing a new chapter in their country's history. It's a land that will fill your heart with warmth from a people who are quite frankly the epitome of hospitality. just um, got through the last checkpoint on the way to Samara going to see the uh, spiral mosque or the spiral minaret I should say <clears throat> we had to hand over our passports at this checkpoint and um, in place of them we got a uh, token so when we return through that checkpoint we give this token back so. hello from Samara we are here at last took a while and by the way they took our token too so now we have no passport and no token but all will be well that's the way it's done that's what you've got to do so we're here this um, minaret is called a Malawiya and it was built in 847 look at that guy up top wow. built in 847 during the Abbasid period. Um, at the time, it was the largest mosque in the world and one of the most fantastic examples of a spiral minaret there is. Incredible. Okay, I'm heading up, heading up the minaret. Here we go. Quite a climb. Thank heavens, they're small steps. Because there's a lot of them. About halfway up. Um, the minaret itself is 52 meters high so quite a minaret especially to be built 1300 years ago incredible feat really for the time thankfully though there's a handrail now of course originally it was just a sheer drop i bet plenty of people have been uh pushed from this over the centuries what's your name i am name ali hakim Ali Hakan, and yeah. you're, you're from Kuch. Kuch in Wasot Mofokie. Uh, I am a graduated science chemistry. Oh, guys. Hi, I'm Mr. My friend. Your friend? Uh, yes, Ali. Ali? Uh, Ali, Ali. Hello. Ali hello. Hello. I'm uh, Mr. in Iran. Visiting today? Just tourists? Yes, yes tourists. Yes. You. Okay. Traveling to Samara, you need to uh, have a military escort to take you to the actual site. And before you get here, you pass by several checkpoints, including uh, four checkpoints where they check your passports. Um, to come independently, you need to find a driver who's able to drive to provinces outside of Baghdad. 
and that driver needs to have paperwork to show at the checkpoints. Um, generally a shared taxi will be about 40,000 dinars each way. Um, I arranged a driver and um, for two of us it's 60 US dollars each. Uh, a little bit pricey, but um, to come north of Baghdad, it's pretty typical. Prices are quite expensive because there is an element of danger here. This area of Samara is um, controlled by a militia. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. 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 It, it is, isn't it? I don't know how you're standing there, to be honest. Really? I don't have a problem with it, really. I mean, get too close, sure. Then it becomes a bit iffy, but I'm quite good while I'm a meter back from the edge. <laughs> it's nice to be up here alone. There'll be more coming soon. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic! Oh my god, I'm in Iraq. I'm in Samara. The oldest still intact Islamic capital in the world. Hello, Samara. Amazing. I don't know. Most people would think it's a wasteland, but I love it. I love the culture. I love the difference. That's why I travel. And to tell you the truth, I think it's pretty safe to come to Iraq especially in the Baghdad government and south of Baghdad. Um, there are pockets of trouble in the north, um, in the north of Iraq proper, not Kurdistan. Um, so I recommend you come, yeah? I'm a solo female traveler here. I have made some Iraqi friends and they've given me some advice, but I'm traveling alone and I'm trying to do it as cheaply as possible. Of course, sometimes going to the sites, it's not possible to uh, scrimp like I normally would in Asia or, or somewhere else. But that's okay. This is quite a spectacular experience. And to be at the forefront of Iraq's tourism industry in, while it's in its infancy, it's a real privilege to be here. I think Iraq's got a great future and I hope the peace lasts. I mean, you're seeing me uh, during my good days. Back in the day, I was a lot, I, I wouldn't have gone up here. Oh, really? Yeah, it's gotten a lot better. I started climbing, uh, like as a sport, recreationally, and that helped a lot. Incredible. So we've just done the climb up and down the minaret. It's hot as hell. I think it must be pushing like 45 degrees or more. Um, but wonderful to be here. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. Woo! <laughs> Thank you guys. We have our security detail. We have Mohammed from Germany. And we have our driver, Ali. Ali, Ali. Ali. Ali, what an awesome driver. Very nice car too, I might add. Security guys. <laughs> hey, guys. Oh, hello. 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 Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Hello. 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 Welcome to Iraq. Woo. What an amazing place. Amazing people. Oh my god, some of the best I've ever met in the world. So friendly, so hospitable. Yeah, let's go. Yalla, yalla. Bye bye. Thank you. Awesome visit. Where? In Auckland? Yes, Auckland. Auckland, very beautiful. Oh, thank you. West Germany, very, very beautiful. Thank you. Thank so you, sir. Hello, Dortmund, Frankfurt, Cologne, yes, yes. Kaiserslautern. <laughs> Everywhere. <laughs> Everywhere beautiful. And the prices to get in? We have uh, 25,000. And information about visiting Samara. Oh.
they even have a, a tourist stand where you can buy your own minaret hello <laughs> okay we've stopped off at a roadside uh, restaurant for some lunch um, it's been a hot afternoon it's been uh, 40 degrees while we we're out and this is a roadside restaurant and you wouldn't expect too much from it however like um, I'm starting to learn Iraqi cuisine is over the top look at what we have for three people quite incredible so we have a chicken biryani salad I've got a chai there which I can't wait to have um, some stews salads pickles and olives fantastic spread yes fantastic yes. fantastic chicken. Ali is it it's good? Good. Very good. 